And as you can see, I'm just working my way down. I've gone back and I've redefined my eyes a little bit. I put some color down in this area, sort of marked out where my nose uh, is basically. And I'm just trying to get uh, fill this up, trying to get the shape right, that sort of thing. Um, Again, I'm still using just my basic mixes that I used from the beginning. And uh, I'm just continuing to, to really uh, just set up these massive areas in some color to see if I'm on the right track. So far, it's, uh, you know, it's coming along. <coughs> I don't want to get too far ahead of myself right now um, in case I want to make some dramatic changes. Of course there won't be anything overly dramatic at this stage, but uh, for example I want to measure my ears, make sure my ears, my ears are coming across at this particular angle just below my, my nose. So I got this ear way up too high to bring that down. It comes down down here somewhere. Again, whenever I want to make any changes, I just do it in turpentine. Alright, come on. The last thing I'm going to put in here right now is the nostrils. Let's see if we can get those in the right spot. And then I'll probably take a break. mustache and all that business is going to be uh, down, down here obviously but uh, I want to make sure that I have these things in position before I even start to think about defining my mustache in my mouth First things first. I'm just you can see I'm just working my way down, trying to pick out relationships and measurements at this right now, knowing that as I look at this uh, tonight and I'll see things that need to be altered and where I might be a little bit out, but um, none of it's terribly important right now. I do want to make sure that these eyes are in the right spot, more or less. And you see, I'm not going to any detail here. All I'm doing is trying to place them, place them. And as I look back and forth the mirror, I'm just checking and just making sure it feels okay. And, uh, And all the time I'm, I'm looking and I'm drawing term in things in relationship to shadow and highlight. So I have a big strong highlight on my nose, and but it's the shadow that I'm trying to accent right now. I'm always thinking in my mind, I'm going to be working from, from dark color overlaid by a lighter color. So always the painting will always be building a lighter, which is an important thing to remember. I don't know if I've said that before, but uh, always go a little bit darker, not tremendously darker, but a little bit darker than your main medium color. And you'll build lighter from there. Yeah, it's starting to look like me. Pretty good. Yeah. <laughs>
Okay. 